Hi everyone, my name is Shiren. So God is saying that your kingdom spouse has very high standards for you. There are certain qualities that he expects from you. And God is also saying that you should also do the same. You should also have high standards for your kingdom spouse. The Bible in the book of Matthew chapter 7 verse 21 says that it is not everyone who says, Lord, Lord, who will enter the kingdom of heaven, but those that do the will of my father, those that do the will of God. God. So this just shows that our maker, God also has high standards for us just because we are his children. It does not mean that we have access to his kingdom. There are certain things that he still expects from us in order to enter into his kingdom. So God is also saying that in your life, you should exercise the same thing just because someone is a woman or just because someone is a man or is a man of God, a woman of God. It does not mean that they they need to have the right to enter into your house, to enter into your life. You should have the standards as well. It should be someone who does the will of God and someone who also does your will. Some of you might be asking yourself that I am doing all the right things when I'm in a relationship. So what is going on? Why aren't I the one who's being considered for marriage? So this is because the man or the woman also has their standards when it comes to the man, when it comes to the person that they wish to marry. So may you be chosen by your kingdom spouse to enter into the heavenlies in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen.